about Sonic. Sonic the Hedgehog. Busting out of jail was no problem. And I found Shadow, too. He won't escape me this time. Again, of all places. I found you, Faker. Faker? I think you're the fake hedgehog around here. You're comparing yourself to me? Huh? You're not even good enough to be I'll my I'll make you eat those words. There's no time to play games. You won't even get the chance. Hey everybody, it's Operation, and welcome back to more Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. In the last part, we got through Metal Harbor and left off with us fighting Shadow. Uh, it's basically the same fight as, uh, and I died. That, that's good. That's a good way to start. <laughs> um, it's basically the same exact fight as before when we were Shadow. So, try to get behind him, homing attack him, and you're good. Pretty much. But uh, gotta admit, falling off the falling off the edge is a legit concern. I don't know. I I think this is the hardest find in the game because I always manage to free fall off like I did again. Apparently, other people do this fight in, like easy, no problem. Me, no, I struggle like crazy. Not to mention the fact that the camera is battling me the whole time. <laughs> But it's weird because the second fight uh, is actually a lot easier for me. I mean, I made it look epic as uh, when I was doing Shadow Story, but I mean, I've at least I didn't, you know. And I'm dead again. Okay, this is getting a bit ridiculous. Can I please stop dying? Please, just let me kill him. Okay, this is really pathetic. <laughs> this is seriously getting to the point of unbelievably pathetic. Tag him. Okay, he's back turned, and I missed. I got him this. All right, that's one hit, and I don't have any rings left. So let's pick up. Okay, we're good. We're good. Okay, let him turn his back. Okay, come on. Okay, there we go. Two hits down. One more hit to go. Miracles! Alright! <laughs> that was horrible! We're never gonna talk about this again. Uh, I, I feel great shame. Great, great shame. Right now, before the island blows up with you on it. Blows up? Alright, so uh, we lost four lives in that shadow fight. Hopefully, the level goes better. Although, knowing me, I wouldn't really count on it. Um, but yeah, I said before that I, uh, preferred, uh, Shadow's version of this level. Uh, we'll see if that holds up through, uh, through the end of this. Because this is one of my favorite Sonic levels. It's just, as I remember it, I remember having more fun with Shadow's version of it. But we'll see. I have an open mind, and maybe at the end of this level I'll prefer Sonic's. I mean, they're really, really similar. So... I don't know, maybe it's kind of pointless saying I preferred one to the other. I think Sonic's is longer, I think. But don't quote me on that. And we got a time limit where we didn't have one as uh, Shadow, so. Yeah, weird. Gold Beetle. Alright, cool, I got the Gold Beetle. Uh, like I said, you get bonus points for the Gold Beetle, so if at all possible, getting them is definitely in your best interests. You know, assuming you care about A ranks. So, I still can't believe it in the last episode. I I got through Metal Harbor and I got to the top of the rocket and I got a B rank. I don't believe it. Uh, 
Gotta love my gotta love my luck with these kinds of things. But so far so good with this round of the level. I think I got all my failure for the video out in <laughs> Shadow Fight. I don't know why. I, again, everyone tells me that that fight's easy, but I struggle with it, so go figure. Alright, let's take the Chainies together. It's only 100 points. I guess I'm. Oh, and I fell. And I fell again. Can I land on something? Hey, cool, I didn't die. Thank you, luck. Thank you for not getting me killed. I mean, I just as easily could have fallen to my doom there. <laughs> Uh luck was on my side this time. Alright. Jump up here, up here. Pretty good. Let's not move this time. Alright. Boom and boom. Very nice. Very nice. We're almost at 200. Hey, 200 rings. So we've gotten two of the four lives we've lost back. <laughs> but, yeah. Um, I, as I said before, I do prefer the hero story to the dark story. I feel the levels th just flow a lot better. Besides Tails levels. Um, because I just don't like the walker in general. Although I do prefer his levels to Eggman's, ironically. So, whatever. Um, Sonic actually has six levels in his story. I don't think I've mentioned that before. Uh, I think I did mention that Shadow only got four. For some reason. Yeah, Shadow's debut game and he gets four levels. <laughs> Whatever, I guess. But hey, we finished the level and I'm like 95% sure that's on A rank. Come on, let me be wrong. Let's see that A rank. I kind of want to redeem myself this episode. A rank? Yeah, A rank. That was cool. Even with falling and almost, you know, almost dying there. But hey, I'll take the A rank. I don't think I deserve it, but I will more than happily take it. Remember when we were playing as Rouge and we had to go out of our way to get the digging gloves? Yeah! Don't have to with Knuckles. <laughs> They're literally right in front of you. But uh, don't worry, there's a really annoying power-up to find with Knuckles too. So we'll be getting to that in a bit. Um, as far as this level goes, my recommendation, just try to glide around the area um, until your radar goes off. It's the best advice I can give you for this level. I usually don't have much difficulty with it, but seeing as I said that, I'll probably struggle with it immensely, so, you know, take it as you will. But um, as far as this level does go, um, it seems that they spread out the emerald locations, so you won't find two emeralds on one mountain, usually. It's all randomly generated, but... That's what I found is that they spread them out for the most part. Let's see. Let's go up here. All right, there we go. We got something going here. This is probably the biggest Knuckles level, except maybe his space level. Maybe his space. I'm not sure which one's bigger. They're about the same size, probably. But I I really do quite well with Knuckles space level, which I probably jinxed. When we get to that episode, uh, be sure to remind me that I jinxed it. Let's go. All right, we're really close, apparently. Red, red, red. Okay. No, I didn't want the hint. Dang it. Screw you, hint system. I cost myself a thousand. I cost myself like 700 points because I was trying to punch the box and instead of punching the box, I activated the hint because they're the same button. Screw you, hint system. You're not helpful. Seriously, don't ever use the hints. They're not as helpful as they were in Sonic Adventure 1. Where it actually would point you in the right direction. And that was before the ranking system too, so it's not like you got punished for using them. <laughs> uh, okay, great. So I have to figure out how to break it. Oh, right there. 
Mystery solved! And let's... No, don't... Screw you! I guess not die. Give me that ring. Okay, now let's just climb back up here. Let's climb back up. It's right there. Let's grab it. Grab it. Perfect. All right. So let's see if we can redeem an A rank out of this. Because, you know, the hint system totally screwed us over earlier. Let's see if we can overcome that, uh, that screw up and still pull that A rank out. All right. If, if it wasn't for the fact that everything looked the same, I'd remember which mountains... I climbed already. I think... I don't think I found one this one. I don't think so. I don't think... But there's something up there, so... Just try and go over here. Again, just try and fly over this area until your radar goes off. There we go. It's close. It, I, kinda, I guess I kind of make it look like I knew that it was over here. But I swear I didn't. Okay, come on. It's right here. There we go. Like I said, the level's not too bad. Um, just keep moving around and your radar will go off and then you're good. So. A rank? Yeah, A rank. So even the hint system didn't screw me up. I approve. So other than the fact that uh, we messed... I, by we, I mean I messed up that uh, shadow fight. It's gone pretty smoothly. Can't complain. Citizens of Earth. Lend me your ears and listen to me very carefully. My name is Dr. Eggman, the world's greatest scientist, and soon to be the world's greatest ruler. Now witness the beginning of the greatest empire of all time. <laughs> The moon is gone? Eggman! Oh, that creep never gives up. But how did he manage to harness all that energy? It's got to be the Chaos Emeralds. Yeah, that's the reason they were looking for him. Tails? The Chaos Emeralds are like magnets. They have the power to attract each other. I can use them to find what Eggman is. You try and find a way out of here. Find Eggman. Got it! The three of you. That means me, too. Hey, wait! Time for Mission Street, which is probably my favorite Tails level. Um, as I've said multiple times already, I think Tails got the better Walker missions than Eggman, but Eggman had my favorite with uh, his final level. I can't remember the name of it right now. Um, but this is probably my second favorite walker level. Um, it's pretty linear, but it keeps you moving like the whole time. And I like that. So if I ever come back and, you know, decide, hey, I want to do uh, one of the walker levels, uh, I basically... Uh, I'd basically go back to Eggman's first, and then this was the one I'd come to second. And now we finally get the booster, which is exactly the same as it was with Eggman. Now we can hover. Uh, press A to jump, and then hold it down, and you're good. So, But yeah, uh, as far as this level, uh, it, it keeps you moving, and you never are really waiting around too long. 
uh, to do to do anything. So it, I don't know. It's I really like the level. It works well in my opinion. Uh, let's see. Okay, if the camera would work, that'd be great. Okay, up here. Come on. Come on. Okay. Now up. I like how I said before you're never really waiting around, <laughs> and then now I'm waiting around. Gotta love how these things work, right? Alright. Up or over. Dang it, I hate these little jet I, I admit though, I hate these jet things. These jet things are really annoying. Uh, there's crates over there. Basically, you gotta hit this. That part of the bridge or platform, whatever, will fall away. And then you just hover over it. So. Let's try and chain together some combos. Because I want Misume ranks. Don't know about you, but I like Misume ranks. Alright. Dang it! Okay, five. I think I crushed myself with a pillar. I'm not sure if that was what caused me damage, or maybe I got shot by an enemy. I'm not really sure. Okay. And that thing almost crushed me. I forgot about that platform. Yeah, that platform will come down and try to crush you. Okay. I just got lucky and outran it. So, uh, yeah, you might want to wait for it to come down before advancing. Like I said, I just got lucky. And no, I don't want to die. Don't make me die. I'm down to one tiny little bit of HP. And now I gotta climb all the way back up. Dang you, game. Why you do this? Uh, anywho. Let's... We gotta hover over this part now. I can do this. And fire. Hey, we got full health. Talk about good timing. Okay. Jump up here. Yeah, I, I, I really shouldn't have said that uh, there's not a lot of weighing around. I guess there kind of is. I forgot about these pillar parts, but I don't know. It's still not that bad. A lot of the walker, like Eggman Sand Walker level, you're basically uh, waiting for those platforms to come around. So, I mean, it, it, compared to ones like that, it's not near as bad. So, again, I still stand by that it's my second favorite walker level. I, I don't really come back to them when I replay this game. I pretty much just stick to the speed characters, but you know, it's not a bad level. Jeez. I forgot how dangerous these things are. Okay, hover over. It's actually kind of stressful <laughs> because it's really easy to die in these walker stages, and I don't want to lose my score. But we're almost to the end, so we should be good. Just gotta get past this last line of defense. And we should be... Okay, watch for this bridge thing here. Yeah, it'll fall down and try to squash us. So just take it a few steps forward, let it fall, and then you're golden. Shoot. I said... Okay, finally it let me lock onto that guy. There we go. And run past it and go ring. All right, very nice. Show me the A rank. Show me the A rank. Come on, A rank, A rank, A rank, A rank, A rank. B. Dang it. Oh well. That's it for this episode, guys. Uh, thank you guys for watching and come back next time where I believe we'll take be taking on a knuckles level. See you guys then.